Hi, I'm Shane, and welcome back to Lori Farm. Yeah, I'm coming, guys. Just give me a second. Oh, we're going to let the ducks and chickens out today to go forage, but we've kind of got to be careful. They've gotten into the pumpkins a little bit on the stand out front so we want to make sure that that's not happening you know when I was a kid I didn't really care for fall much it wasn't really that I didn't like the weather or anything like that it just kind of was the end of summer Hey, good morning, kitty cats. Yeah, what are you doing? Good morning, pretzel. Let's check on you guys and see what you're doing. Holy smokes. You guys are running all over the place. Oh, we got to get you some water. You know, one thing about fall that I always enjoyed was hunting with my family, with my dad, my brothers, and stuff like that. But I think what it mainly was is it was always back to school. Or, you know, back to a place I didn't really feel like I wanted to be at. I think that's pretty common. All right, yeah, let's get some water. And then we'll get some food too, because you know who's not hungry, right? Hey, you're not supposed to be in there. There, is everybody happy now? Yeah, you look happy. I think we're gonna have to get them out of that tote real soon. There are kinda too many of them in there, so. But with it being as cold as it is, it's really nice to have them kinda contained to that spot um, to uh, keep them nice and warm. So, yeah, last night there was a pretty hard freeze, so. Okay, Deuce, I'm working on it, dude. There, are you happy? Get some breakfast. Why don't you guys get up there and get some breakfast, too? There's a bowl for you. I was reading an article yesterday that said petting a dog's head is really good for your brain. Really good for calming your emotions. Got me thinking, what does it do when you pet a cat? What are you girls doing? Go find some food. There's breakfast over there. But now I find myself kind of liking fall. You know, it's good work and weather, that's for sure. Temperatures aren't too high, so you're not sweating your butt off. You're kind of doing fun activities, you know, different stuff, chopping wood and, you know, things I should have done earlier in the year. You look cute. They're crazy. What are we making? Uh, potato soup. Oh, awesome. I can find my bay leaves. And we're gonna make oh, you get some potato. venison sausage in here? I do. Nice. And then we're going to make pumpkin pies. Liv, what you working on? Um, meeting. Meeting? Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if that's meeting. Breaking doing, up the meat. You're doing a good job, though. I got to go get this back bucket off the tractor. Oh, and even though I'm not much of a fan of fall, I know Sarah here is. We're How's just it going? Good. Out loading up the wood, bringing oh, okay. it up to the house for fires this winter. But it's a beautiful fall day. It's one of my favorite seasons. I love all the 
uh, animals quacking in the back. The nice cooler weather. Pumpkin season, apple orchard season. And then pretty soon fires in the fireplace. It's just a gorgeous time of year where you can get yard work and other stuff done and not sweat to death. Another thing I really enjoy about fall is that there are no bugs. I do not miss mosquitoes and horse flies. We had such a problem with horse flies this summer that it's a relief not to have to deal with them till next year now. All right, I think this load's ready to go, otherwise we're gonna topple over. So this will provide a lot of heat for cheap, which is nice. I especially like having uh, fires around Christmas time. But there's nothing better than the smell of a fire going in your house, in your fireplace. It's very fall, winter feeling. Now I just wish we had a log slither. You do. Other than my husband. Daisy! Well, since this is what we're going to be doing, I'm going to film it. Daisy! So, how far down in there is she? She's down in there. You see her? This is how I get tetanus. Daisy! Are you able to get her? We are in greenhouse number one. Um, I planted some lettuce and Swiss chard back in July for a fall harvest and it is ready to be picked. So we're gonna have salad tonight with our dinner. So it's kind of a sad day because it's literally the last thing we have left to harvest. It's weird how um, spring you get prepped and everything gets so exciting. You got all these fun projects to do. And then summer, you harvest pretty much all summer long. And fall is just kind of prepping for winter and taking things down. So it's kind of the only thing I hate about fall is then you're done gardening for the year. I mean, I have a few things going in the house, of course, but. And with that, the gardening season is over. Ducks are eyeing me. I hate standard screws, but I am enjoying this fall weather today. Boy, this is nice. Well, it only took me five years to put a handle on this door, so better late than never, I guess. Hey girls, I got a new door for you. You're gonna be really excited about this, I can tell. Works perfect. How come you in there by yourself? Huh? How come you how come you're not over there with your friends? Huh? Did somebody get put in the penalty box? Is that what happened? Was somebody being mean to Lucky? Yeah, I think you got put in the penalty box for a little bit. Nope. Five more minutes and then you can go play with your friends. Foghorn, where are you going? Yeah, don't be hurting nobody. Well, a couple of other fall projects I gotta get is these posts in the ground before things freeze, so we're out working on that today. But I was just in having lunch and I told Sarah I haven't bought the metal gates yet and I'm a little nervous about putting in the post on the other side and not having the dimension correct. I really don't wanna have to move it. One of the other things I did today is I got the farm cart moved, so that's good. I uh, got it away from the other location. Um, we ended up having to uh, move it to the other side of the driveway so that the uh, dump trucks could get the dirt pile out of the back uh, last week or whatever that was. So got that moved over there where it's supposed to be. A little bit easier for people to see it as they're driving by, so that's good. And then eventually the farm uh, hay wagon's going to actually sit right there. Um, there'll be a fence that goes across there we're working on later today. So people will be able to pull on the driveway and right to the farm cart.
Well, we're coming along pretty good, but the inspector showed up and stopped us, so we're going to have to talk with her. It's looking good. Dang right, it's looking good. What? Why isn't it finished? So then on this one over here, basically what you're going to have is, is this fence is just going to come all the way across and kind of make it look like it has a false gate. Mm -hmm. That way it matches the other side where the gate is. And then we'll just move the hay wagon over here and park it on the back side of the fence so that people can access it when they come in. Sounds good. I like it. This looks really great. Yeah. Good work, boys. Mm -hmm. I think I'll keep you around. You're proven useful. Geez, what a beautiful fall day. Yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. Cool. Let's go down by the pond. All right. <laughs>